Welcome back. Dr. Mike Sevilla from Salem Community Hospital is here because June is Firework National Firework Safety Month, which is appropriate since obviously the beginning of July is when everyone is using them. That's right. Welcome, first of all, and I also want to say that we do not condone the use of illegal fireworks. You should always obey your laws. However, when using some of the fireworks, there are some things you can do to be safe because you guys see a lot of people come in with injuries related to them. Yeah, when talking about injuries, you know, the latest statistics that they have is from 2008, and they have about 7,000 injuries that are that were documented there. And injuries can be, you know, from you know, severe burns, especially of the face, um, uh, and also injuries of the hands and mm -hmm. the fingers um, and also uh, blindness as well uh, and even something like sparklers that look pretty in innocent and that you give to your kids exactly temperatures can be you know 2,500 degrees or even more so that's something that we really worry about when it comes to injuries so how do we make sure we're doing using them safely well absolutely I mean there's no you know fireworks indoors at all um, and especially for kids you know always have adult, adult supervision. supervision have a uh, you know, bucket, bucket of water around in case you're in any problems and absolutely never never relight you know a because um, that might be where you get the face injury. You're just or... asking for trouble then. Okay, good <laughs> advice right there. If you have more questions about it, certainly going to be talking about this as we get closer to the 4th. Be sure to go to our website for more information, and you can also call as well. Dr. Sevilla, thanks for coming in. Thank you. We'll be right back after this.